Hello everybody, this is Leilin here you with you on another videos. In today's video, we will discuss about our payroll, how it will look like, how it's work and what are the features of our Bina Pro payroll hub. Okay, so before start the videos, I will just mention one thing that thank you for all your supports, all our viewers, all our subscribers to watch our videos and if you are new to us, please subscribe our channel and don't forget to press the bell icon for more updates. Okay, so let's start about our payroll models. Okay, so as you can see, Whenever you uh, log into our uh, Bina Pro application, you, you will get this screen. Then after you will uh, click on each module and work as your own. Okay. So now in today's video, I will uh, show about our payroll, how a, a payroll works, how it looks like, how, uh, what are the features we have. And the, so as you can see, the menus and sub menus are available in our payroll models okay firstly uh, we go to the maintain page and these are the sub menu of our maintain page that is branch department zip type leaf code loan master pay code manage holiday insurance employee occupation work type master these are the sub menus of our uh, you know menus of under maintain so if you have to uh, put the branch name, you have to click on the branch and then add and then click on the add button and you have to put your branch name, your branch code, your uh, addresses and then submit. As I already put the data for, uh, you know, uh, testing purpose, that's why it will showing here. Okay. Then you likewise you have to put the department's details, you have to put zip type, leave code, loan master, pay code, manage holiday, insurance, employee, occupation, work type master. You have to put all the data of in of these all these features by clicking the add button. Okay. Now I'm showing how you put the employees data, how you add a employees, okay. When you whenever you click on the employees, like you see the three employees name I already put for the testing purpose. I have to go through the one employees and click on the edit button. Like you see, I already put the data of the employees. You have to put the basic details of the employees, you have to put the work details bank details likewise other details education details work experience and then press the save button okay once you uh, press the save button if you want to put their salary setup you will directly go through this or else you can go to the salary setup click over the employees and put their salary here okay click on the salary setup put their effective dates uh, put the put all the uh, pay heads amount and then update if you have any more um, pay head name you, you just simply go through the pay code and give giving the pay, giving your pay head name it will shown in this page and you have to simply uh, put the amount and then update okay after that, uh, like I say, I just want to, uh, you know, create a employees uh, pay register report so that uh, after salary setup, I have to go the pay frequency setup. I just set up a frequency, click the add button and here is the field is coming and you have to set a frequency after, and then uh, put all the data then submit it once you uh, set up a frequency directly go through the payroll and manage attendance okay you just firstly you have to manage a employees attendance choose your company's name choose your frequency which you already uh, put in this frequency setup 
and also you have to choose your department your location and then show employees here is the 2024 uh, frequencies numbers employee is coming you just have to update it once you updated it it will show in manage payroll okay go to the manage payroll and choose your companies choose the location choose the frequency remember the frequency number is very very important okay so choose your frequency like you see the employees name under 2024 frequencies uh, is coming here you have to just click on the checkbox and then run it okay once it's running it will be so in the reports if you have to check your pay register go through the report click on the pay register and then select your frequency here you go all the uh, 2024 frequencies under employees will show here okay here is the employees uh, salary details and all the employees details here okay so if you like this video and if you want to know more about us you can also uh, go through our link that is www.binapro.com if any other queries you just uh, you know comment it in our comment box okay so thank you for watching us keep watching us keep loving us and do not forget to subscribe our channel and also do not forget to press the bell icon for more updates thank you if you are like my videos please like it and please uh, you know uh, subscribe it thank you